Hi, my name is Nana Adun. I am currently a dance instructor here at Black Rock um, Center of the Arts. I am also a program coordinator here as well. I'm teaching classical ballet for teens and adults, as well as two other uh, ballet classes for children. And I'm also teaching contemporary modern for ages 16 and up. They're all open um, level classes. You know, come on in and we'll have a fun time. I would probably be doing one of two things. Pursuing my original idea of going to medical school and doing biology and all that jazz, or I would still be performing and most likely doing music or theater. I got my start in dance in elementary school, do musicals. Um, the first musical was Annie. <laughs> And it's been around 16 years since I started. Just say that. So initially, um, I was a bio major in college, and I love bio. I use that in my classes. I'm, I do talk about anatomy and physiology. Um, I'm very passionate about that. Uh, I just realized while I was in college. I was spending more of my time caring about my dance classes than I did my bio classes. Well, I shouldn't say my bio classes. Really, when it came to physics, I was just very much, I don't, I didn't like it. I don't want to do physics. Um, and I realized I was very passionate about dance. And I was like, I think there needs to be some kind of switch here. And I didn't do that automatically. I switched to other science majors like public health and other majors. Then I went into dance because I was like, obviously it's dance is the thing I'm looking for. I don't have a favorite. I think they're all applicable. I think they all they all go together. I I do a lot of genres, <laughs> um, but I can. I consider myself a modern dancer overall. Um, so if it was to be a favorite, I probably would be doing modern. I do think there is favor in being a versatile dancer and having multiple styles under your belt, even though you are primarily one dancer. So for me, even though I do modern, I do do a lot of jazz and musical theater and other styles, Ballet has kind of helped helped me understand where my body is in space, um, but as well as my other styles have helped inform me in my ballet. Yeah, so the most profound moment was last um, last year, um, Feb uh, mid February, um, early March, when I was taking uh, modern technique with Kendra Portier. Um, a lot of um sorry she there was some blissful moment taking that class that i haven't had since um and it must be and it became kind of a outer body experience like i just felt free moving in her class and that being said her movement for me is very difficult she tends to change directions a lot she will stop the momentum and do something else and for me that drives me nuts because I love momentum. I'm like, if we're going left, we're going to go left all the way until I feel some reason then to go right. And hers is, we go left, then right, then back to front, then right, then right, then left. And you're like, wait, what is going on here? But for some reason, I don't know if it was just the community that was in the class. And it's also her teaching as well and how she brings her teaching. I take a lot of that in my own class. I try to emulate not copy, but you know, be inspired through that um, kind of teaching to have that idea of imagery and sixth sense of like, this is not just the dance, you know, it's not just movement, it's not a workout, it's something a bit more. It's, it's what separates it from being like monotonous, like cardio and what you end up seeing on stage when you actually get into that moment and you see people like actually perform. And I think it also helped that I was dancing with 
other prof um well now I am a professional but <laughs> I mean I was at that point too but other professionals you know seasoned professionals um, it was mixed in with grad students at UMD and having those people be there as well kind of setting the vibe of the room because it kind of helped too so when we were all on the same page taking class together it gave something for me each morning to look up to and i had to get up really early because that class was like at nine and i didn't live on campus i commuted from here um which is a 40 40 to 40 to 45 minute commute depending on traffic um to over there so it was a bit much but i felt like it was worth it doing going through that class and getting to be able to move um, with people who love moving, you know, and that class is full, filled with people who are not modern dancers. But as some, for some reason, when we were dancing, it just was, it was a connection that you don't get otherwise. <laughs> Jalof Rice, Into the Woods, New York, Fall, Red, The Incredibles, Whitney Houston. I feel like we would cackle. I feel like, I feel like she's a fun time and I would want to get into that. Yeah.